welcome back. Today I have a collective haul to share with you. I did pick up some more pieces for our Bali holiday which is coming up really soon now. We're leaving in about a week's time. I picked up something from Hermes, some maxi dresses, I scored something on Zimmerman sale and I also ended up finding the perfect leather strap conversion kit for my new Longchamp mini lip liage pouch so I can use it as a carefree holiday bag. And we also have a little haul for baby C. I picked up some really cute outfits for her from Zimmerman and Camilla and bought her a new bikini from Zimmerman which I'm really excited to share with you. So if you're interested in finding out what baby C's haul looks like for our bar, trip. Stay tuned right till the end of the video. I thought it might be a little bit of fun showing you her cute new outfits. So why don't I start by showing you the conversion kit that I ended up going with. I mentioned in my previous video where I unboxed this pouch bag that in the US you guys have a lot more option and I think a brand called Dress Up Your Purse is really popular for these conversion kits for the Longchamp pouch bags. But the price converted in Australian dollars plus the shipping fees were just way too much. It just wasn't going to be worth buying that one for me all the way from Australia. So I ended up finding a local seller based in Australia and I got a really nice sturdy strap. There was also a site discount so I believe I only paid something like 35 Australian dollars for this strap and conversion kit and it arrived pretty quickly. The leather quality looks amazing. You can't even tell the difference between this leather and the actual Longchamp leather. Perfect color match. The texture looks so seamless and the conversion hooks they feel so secure on the handle. So my conversion kit is from a brand called LNS Leather. I'll link them down below. They have no idea who I am. I just found it on Google search and ordered it and I really love the quality. But I have to be honest, the only thing that I had trouble with was putting these conversion rings on because they were so, so tight. I guess tight is good once you have them on because you want your straps to be really secure on your handle. But putting them on was so hard. I feel like I lost feeling in my fingers trying to stretch the leather to close the snap but other than that little struggle installing these D-rings it has been absolutely perfect really happy with it it does have different length settings and as you can see this is the bag that I've been using this has been my go-to everyday bag it has been raining on and off here in Sydney so I just love that this pouch is so carefree and with the conversion kit oh my goodness game changer I have been really enjoying this and I'm really excited to take this with me to Bali it's gonna be the perfect crossbody airport bag, sightseeing bag, and this color goes with everything in my wardrobe. I decided tan brown just works with me so well that tan brown is like my black. It is my go-to neutral and I'm okay with the fact that I have multiple bags in this kind of brown color. It is the perfect neutral for my wardrobe. It will go with all my outfits in Bali and I love that this brown is not like a dark dead brown. It's like a lively vibrant brown. So yeah, I'm really excited that I finally found a really good conversion kit. So for my fellow Aussies, I will leave them linked below. Next up, let me show you some new outfits I picked up. As I mentioned, I picked up a few new maxi dresses. Maxi dresses are my favorite things to wear on holiday and in summer in general. They are just so comfortable, but they keep your legs sort of covered in case it's a little windy or you get cold easily in the evenings. So yeah, I just love maxi dresses and I just can't have enough of them. The one that I'm wearing is the first one that I'll show you. I love these burnt orange color, the crisp sort of cottony material. The smock detail is always so flattering. It gives you that really nice feminine figure and the tiered skirt is the perfect length on me. I also love that you can wear it off shoulder or bring it up and wear it as a wide boat neck. I also wanted to mention it has pockets which will be so handy especially on holiday. If I'm carrying a mini bag and I want to hold my phone in my hand to take photos, I love having pockets. This dress is from Goelia and I also picked up some new outfits from Goelia. Goelia. So this portion of the video does continue on my collaboration with Goelia. If you guys didn't know, it is one of my go-to clothing brands at the moment. Love their quality, love how comfortable their designs are. They really thought about how they designed their pieces because every single outfit I put on, they are not only so flattering on, but they're just so comfortable. I often browse their store on Pitt Street Mall here in Sydney to look for what's new. And so I am so grateful to have this ongoing regular partnership with them. So if you like any of the outfits that I show you today, I'll leave links to everything down below. And I do have a discount code, which I'll leave on screen and in the description section below. So don't forget to check out Go 
Zoelia. The next dress I picked up is this beautiful cream colored dress. I wanted to have an option where my arms are a little covered. I love the puff sleeves, a little V cut out on the neckline and the silhouette of the skirt. It also comes with this belt. This one is so comfortable. The material is super soft, very feminine. And out of all the dresses, this is probably the most everyday looking dress as well. You know how some dresses look a lot more resorty, so you don't tend to really wear those ones in your everyday life. But a dress like this can even be dressed up because of this material. So this will be another great versatile piece that I can wear to really anything in Bali and even when I'm back here in Sydney. There's one more Goelia dress I picked up, which is this black spaghetti strap maxi dress with the fine white floral print. This one feels so silky on the skin. Love the design, how it's got the two sets of the spaghetti straps, adding a little bit of fun to an otherwise very simple silhouette. My favorite thing about this dress is that it has the built-in bras, which means with the spaghetti straps, I don't have to bother with wearing a strapless bra. I've mentioned this before, but I hate strapless bras. I feel like they never do a good job. You have to make them quite tight for them to stay in place. And that makes them really uncomfortable. But if you don't have them tight enough, they're just gonna fall and not hold anything. So I love the fact that I can be extra comfortable on my holiday. Don't even have to wear a bra can't get better than that. I feel that this dress is really slimming on my body. Yes, I have lost a lot of weight, but my midsection is still a little bit larger than what it was like before my pregnancy. But when I put this dress on, I felt like Wow, I look quite slim. By the way, I'm just showing you my try-on shot from earlier this morning because I noticed the length is a little long on this particular dress. So I've already took it to my alterations lady. So she's gonna have it ready for me by the end of today. That is why I did a quick try-on shot for you before I took it to the lady. Speaking of built-in bras, I love that a lot of Goelia's camis actually come with the built-in bra. This is another crop cami. The length is perfect. I love how flowy and romantic it looks. The material looks so luxurious. And the best part, of course, it has the built-in bras. I find crop top camis a little difficult to wear because crop tops in general can look a little trashy if you don't find the right silhouette. So even though I love crop cami tops, I don't often wear them because I find it really difficult to find ones that don't make me look trashy. But this one is the perfect sort of cami top because it does have that really elegant material, really elegant flow to it. So a really pretty cami top. I did get another black crop top. This one is a more fitted style. I would match this with looser bottoms, like a loose pair of white pants. If you wear something like this with more relaxed bottoms. It does make for a more elegant look as opposed to if I was to wear something like this and then a short mini skirt that is really tight. I don't think that will look really nice for my own taste. But yeah, this is another great basic piece that I am sure I'm gonna get so much wear out of in summer in general. I got another really cute singlet top that has this cute braided detail in this same burnt orange color. I don't know, I really, really love this color. I feel that it looks nice on my complexion and it's not a boring color. It's almost like a neutral because it can go with all the neutral accessories like tan brown bags, shoes, white bags, white shoes even black. So this color is so easy to accessorize, but at the same time, it's not a boring color. It is so saturated. The material is so breathable and it is a really relaxed silhouette. I love the tie detail at the back. It is just such a cute design. Next up is this really pretty short sleeve cream colored blouse with all these ruffly details, these pretty little buttons. You have the little elasticated detail on the arms, tiny bit of a puffy sleeve. It is a very romantic shape. Blouses like these are so great in summer and for your summer vacations. These types of blouses are so versatile as well. You can wear them casually with a pair of denim shorts, but you could also totally dress this up if you have a nice dinner reserved or something. You could pair this with some more dressier bottoms and when you're back home, I feel like you could even wear something like this to work with some work pants. So love the versatility. Again, the material just feels so comfortable on the skin. And lastly, I got a two-piece set in the black. The top is a crop top and the bottoms are just comfortable elasticated waist pants. These will be the perfect lounge wear. I always take a couple of these sorts of loungy comfortable pieces with me whenever I'm traveling. I love I love the way this one drapes around my body. It's quite a stretchy material, so it'll be super comfortable. Love the little twist 
detail on the crop top and I love the proportions. The pants are quite high-waisted paired with the crop top. It gives a little peak of the midsection but not too much so I find this kind of outfit is a nice way to wear a crop top. And again the pants are with my alterations lady. This one was also a little bit long on me so she's taking up the length for me and I can't wait to get this back. So these are all of the pieces that I got from Goelia. I always mention this but most of their pieces run true to size so I got size small for everything which is my usual size. Thank you so much to Goelia for our ongoing collaborations. I absolutely love my outfits. Can't wait to wear them in Bali. Don't forget to check them out through the links I've left in the description section below and use my discount code if you end up liking any of the outfits. Next up I did pick up a maxi dress from a brand new to me. It's a French brand called Mes Demoiselles if I'm pronouncing that correctly. I picked up this really interesting looking maxi dress. As soon as I saw it, I thought it'll look perfect for Bali. I just stumbled upon this brand from one of those stores that stock a lot of different brands at a local shopping center here in Sydney. One of my friends recommended this particular boutique. So I went to browse with her and found this gem of a maxi dress. So when I did some research when I got home, I found that they're a French brand and they do some really sort of more unique dresses and I thought it is a dress that I'm gonna wear for many many summer vacations to come and I think it'll be something that I can dress up for different occasions when I'm here in Sydney too you know for nice dinners functions so even though it was a brand new designer to me I fell in love with it as soon as I tried it on I haven't seen anything like this sort of a design anywhere so really love the uniqueness of it I love how they divided the top and the skirt portion of this dress but this one was actually quite long on me so I already already had it altered with my alterations lady. I found that they are stocked on Farfetch as well so I browsed on there and found quite a few styles that I really like. So I have a feeling that this brand will become one of my go-to brands. Next up I picked up a couple of pieces from Zimmerman. So the first one is this really pretty maxi dress that I scored on Zimmerman sale. I actually only went into Zimmerman to pick up some nice outfits for baby C but when I was in there of course I had to browse around and found that this color looked really Really nice. I didn't even know they were having a sale but when I saw the price tag I was like I have to try it on and I loved this so it was an instant decision to take. I'm quite picky when it comes to buying Zimmerman pieces because I find that a lot of their prints are a little bit too seasonal meaning everyone can date a print back to a certain season and after a few seasons they just start to look a little dated so I usually try and go for patterns and prints that are not so season specific looking anyway. So I love that this one just looks like a nice floral dress but it doesn't scream any particular season. I love the tie neck, all these roughly details and the skirt is in layers. I also love how the hem is higher at the front and lower at the bottom. It gives the dress a bit more of a 3D element. So I still have the tag on it. This one originally retailed for 625 Australian dollars but it was down to 315 and when I saw that I was like for a nice Zimmerman maxi dress that is really worth it. This is another one of those dresses that looks so nice on your vacation but will also be a really nice everyday dress once I'm back. So really happy that I scored a bit of a deal on this one. I also got myself some new bikinis from Zimmerman. That is the top and I do have the high bottoms. I don't know if I mentioned this before but all of my bikinis from my pre-pregnancy days I noticed the bottoms are all very low bottoms and I noticed I still feel a lot more comfortable with high tops at the moment even though I lost a ton of weight. I feel like my lower belly pooch is still there. I don't know if it'll ever go away but whatever makes me comfortable and more great in right. So I was hunting for a pair of bikinis with the high tops and guys they're actually not that easy to find. Hermes used to do some styles in their swimsuits with the high bikini bottoms but my essay told me that they don't have any anymore and they may even be discontinuing the high bottoms. So I actually went in to try on this new style in the one piece. I love the look of it on the website but when I tried it it just wasn't flattering on my body something about the proportions was off. The whole one-off shoulder cut me off at a really awkward place and made this bit look really sort of flabby. So I did not like that at all on me, which I was really bummed about. So it was probably a couple of days later that I went to Zimmerman. And when I saw this, I thought it had a sort of a similar vibe, obviously at a fraction of the price, which is always really nice, but it just looked pretty flattering on my current figure. So if you're a mummy, 
and you want to still wear bikinis, but you do feel a little bit conscious about your lower belly, I definitely recommend checking this set out. The print is not so out there again. It's not a Zimmerman floral print that you can date back to a certain season. So I feel like this will be quite timeless. Next up, let's finally have a look at what I picked up from Hermes before you get into baby C's vacation haul. I found one thing I really liked from that visit. From this box, I'm sure a lot of you who have shopped from Hermes before would know what kind of an item this is. I feel like half the time with luxury unboxings, the box gives away a lot of information. So let's open this up together. Ta -da! Oh my goodness, how beautiful and vibrant are these colors? Do you see a theme here? I don't know, I'm just really into this sort of orangey color at the moment. So I picked up a 90 by 90 centimeter square silk scarf in this new season print. Let me just get this the right way up. My essay told me it's the Paris for Borg store out sailing. How pretty is that? So you can see the Fabolg store in the middle. It's become a little ship and it's on water. If you watched my previous video on the only items that I still have on my luxury wish list, you know that I have been looking for a new Hermes scarf in the 90 by 90 centimeters because I do love wearing these as little tops. I do have a whole video on how to wear these, several different ways to wear these scarves as tops. I especially love doing that on my summer vacations, but I only had a couple of these which I've worn them so much on my previous holidays that I wanted a brand new fresh colorway added to my little collection of these scarves. What I loved about this design and print and colorway is that you do have some vibrant orangey colors with yellows, but at the same time, the blue really breaks it up. And I actually love looking at the prints. It's a piece of artwork. There are so many different design elements. This is my third Hermes silk scarf in this size that I can wear as a top. Aside from the fact that they look so resorty, this is also the most affordable way to wear a piece of Hermes as a clothing piece. You won't be able to buy a silk top from Hermes for this kind of a price point. Even though they had a bit of a price increase on these scarves. I remember my old ones to be about $700, but I believe this one went up to something like, was it $875? But even then, it is a beautiful scarf beautiful top quality silk and if you can wear these multiple different ways as a top rather than just a scarf I think that price point is really worth it. The actual silk tops will probably start around two to three thousand Australian dollars so I'm really happy to have added another silk scarf to my collection in a complete different colorway than the ones I already own. If you guys are still with me watching this video, thank you guys so much for sticking with me. Now I'm just gonna do a little extra bonus section of showing you Baby C's vacation haul. So let me show you what I picked up for her from Zimmerman first. I picked up this cute little strappy dress. Oh my goodness, how adorable is this? I love the ropey straps. The color is just so, so beautiful. Love the smock detail. And look at the skirt. The details are just so gorgeous. I can't wait to put this on her. I got this in the size two, even though she's only one, because one, she's pretty tall, but two, I also wanted to get more time out of her wearing this because once we're back from Bali, we're gonna start going into summer here in Sydney from say November, it will start to get warm. I wanted her Bali outfits to be big enough that we can wear them in our upcoming summer here in Sydney as well. So really, really cute. And these are her little bikinis. Let me show you them properly. They're so little and cute. Look at that color. Yellow looks really good on baby C and the design I thought was just so cute with that little bow at the front. Again, the straps are adjustable. <laughs> so cute. And then the bikini bottoms are just simple bottoms with the little bows on the sides. I just fell in love with this color. And this material is a little bit thicker. It almost feels a little bit like a towel-y material. I thought that would be quite nice and comfortable. And it looks like it's going to be pretty fast drying as well. So yeah, that is her little bikini, which I'm so excited to put on her. And we got her a cute little dress from Camilla. Camilla is another Australian brand. They're really famous for their captain's beach wears, embellished with beautiful crystals. I do have a dress that I always take on holiday with me, which I also dress up for special occasions, which I'll insert a photo of on screen. I don't normally like majority of their styles because they're usually really long, really relaxed. I feel like you need to be really tall and have a model's figure to really pull out a lot of their styles, but I do occasionally like some of their stuff. 
So I was just casually browsing online and I noticed that they do have little baby section as well. So of course I started scrolling and found this cute smoke dress and I fell in love with the color, the design. So I went into the store, checked it out, tried this on BBC, loved it. So I got it. Again, I got this in the size 2 so she can get a little more wear out of it for our upcoming summer towards the end of the year. Aren't the colors just so gorgeous? Love the florals. And these are a lot more reasonably priced than the Zimmerman baby's dresses. I believe the Zimmerman baby dress was 220 Australian dollars, which is a lot of money for baby's clothes that they're only gonna get to wear for a few months, but you know, I just couldn't resist. But most of Camilla's styles in this baby size are about 150 Australian dollars. So I did not go overboard. I only bought two sort of very special dresses for baby C for our holiday. And the rest of her outfits, I generally buy from a brand called Pure Baby. They do organic cotton. I think they are an Australian brand. So I bought her a few nice pieces from Pure Baby as well. I'll just show you one dress that I really love this is a pure baby dress in the organic cotton it just feels really nice it's a cute design the colors are really beautiful and this one retails for $59 but they had a 20% off at David Jones so I believe I paid $44 for it so the rest of her outfits are mainly from more affordable brands but I'm so excited to have gotten a couple of very special pieces for her for our first overseas holiday as a family of three. So that is everything that I got for Bali. I am planning on vlogging our Bali trip. So if you want to see my outfits and accessories in action, do make sure you're subscribed to my channel and come back for my new videos. I'll also show you how these outfits look on Baby C in our Bali vlog. Thank you again to Goelia for our ongoing collaboration. Do make sure you check Goelia out. All the links are below along with my discount code. I hope you enjoyed this collective haul. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. As always, thank you so much for watching and spending some of your precious time with me today. And I can't wait to see you again soon in my next video. Bye guys.